What is going on YouTube? You're watching Next Gen Speed. Today we have a Mears 6th Gen Camaro SS right here in the shop. And today we have a part from Extreme Online Store being installed on the vehicle, which are these Carbon Flash SS dive plane canards. So if you guys seen the Z01 one in the model, it does come with these factory to give it a more aggressive look, kind of more downforce, but pretty much just for the looks on this one. But as you can see, it's a pretty much install just like this. Oh yeah. There you go. So pretty much just look just like that, kind of give an aggressive appearance and add a little bit more downforce, you know. So I'm gonna be installing these today, showing you guys how to do it, doing a little overview and showing you guys how these are. So Extreme Online Store did include some rivets with these. We're actually gonna only be using a few of these just to get them on the vehicle, but we're gonna be using some self-tapping screws to get the rest in. So as you can see on each dive plane, we have a bunch of screw holes right here. You pretty much need to put this on the vehicle first, drill the holes in, and then get it bolted in to get it all set in place. So I'm about to get started right now, put this on the vehicle, get the holes lined up, and then start drilling the holes. Got the holes marked on the bumper right now. So now we're just gonna drill out the holes, get the first one put on. Pretty straightforward process, pretty nice and easy. The main part is actually just lining it up, make sure every side is equal. And obviously the scariest thing is drilling into your actual bumper, but as long as you get them lined up correctly, you should be good to go. Let me find out for you. I'm just trying to see exactly what size this one is using. Okay. I'm trying to see what looks uh... Seconds. All right, so the drill bit you will need to be using is a 730 second drill bit for these. Do recommend the pilot hole first. A pilot hole? Yeah, so it's just like smaller. Mm -hmm. So you can just uh, kind of like it's easier to control and it doesn't make it look all messy. So you okay. do the pilot hole first and then finish with the actual size you need. Awesome. and clean just make sure you don't go too deep because you don't know what's behind there you don't want to like drill up any like uh wires or anything like that or any plastic fillers behind there just try to be like nice and easy with it so we got two rivets in so far i'm about to push in real quick do you want to drill the other side before you rivet in? Or do you want to do well, one side by one side? I'll do uh, one side and then the other side. Okay. I just put those just so like it doesn't move and like mm -hmm. we can mark the holes that I need. True. And that way everything will be lined up. Because mm -hmm. you have to drill all the holes before you rivet them in because you are not going to get a drill in here. Oh yeah, true. So now I got the rest of the holes marked up. I'm just gonna pile it and then drill them through. So got this side going, all ready to go for the dive planes on. I'm gonna look crazy with this bumper. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so we got both sides drilled out. Now it's time to get the rivet gun and add some rivets in there. Go. Got one in so far. And there we go. Coming along nicely so far, guys. Right. Bye. Bye. 
So we have the dive plane canners officially on the vehicle. And some more risks to give, make sure it's nice and stationary. Make sure it does not move at all because you do not want these flying off, especially going at high speeds. But got all finished up. Looking nice, guys. Definitely ties in the front end. Measures the car perfectly with all that carbon flash metallic on it. Especially with the gloss back on the car. Definitely does give it an aggressive look. You like it, Amir? I love it. <laughs> Now, if you want to grab a set of these, make sure to check out the link in the description below at nextgenspeed.com. We got mini Camaro parts, such as these guys, front splitters, die planes, grills, side skirts, anything you need pretty much from spoilers, interior parts, from lighting to anything you pretty much need. So stay tuned in the near future. We'll be putting a carbon fiber wing on this boy to tie in all the ground effects it's got on it. It's definitely going to be looking more badass in the near future. So please like and subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys next time.